President Trump plans to visit California next week for the first time since he took office. And while he's here, he's expected to discuss his administration's lawsuit to overturn sanctuary policies in California. KPIX 5 reporter Ed Makovec joins us now with more on the feds versus California. Yeah, Attorney General Jeff Sessions announced that lawsuit in Sacramento yesterday. Governor Jerry Brown called it an act of war. And today, President Trump again threatened to pull funding from sanctuary jurisdictions. You want the money, you can't have the sanctuary cities. That way we avoid the court battles all the time. The big one right now, a 45-page lawsuit filed by the Department of Justice against the state of California. It takes aim at three laws. One requires private employers to give notice before cooperating with ICE. Another prevents police from tipping off immigration agents. The third stops ICE from keeping detainees in local jails. Federal law is the supreme law of the land. And just as the Attorney General did yesterday, President Trump today lashed out at Oakland Mayor Libby be Schaff. What the mayor of Oakland did the other day was a disgrace. He's referring to Schaff's informing the public about recent immigration raids and he claims letting 800 undocumented immigrants get away. It's certainly something that we're looking at with respect to her individually. What she did is incredible and very dangerous. Schaff has hired a lawyer and continues to fight back. How dare you vilify members of our community? By trying to frighten the American public into thinking that all undocumented residents are dangerous criminals. Senator Dianne Feinstein tweeted this morning, ICE's targeting and intimidation of immigrants with no criminal backgrounds is forcing entire communities to live in fear. I'm proud of California's efforts to combat this and protect its residents. As the governor vows to fight every step of the way. It's vicious rhetoric. Uh, of an administration that wants to divide America and hold on to power by uh, blaming other people. It's tragic, it's profoundly un-American, and California will fight it in every legal way that we can conceive. Now, as for that threat from the president on pulling federal funds, so far that's been ruled unconstitutional. San Francisco and Santa Clara counties already sued about this issue and won their original case as well as an appeal. Michelle.